How'd you so, get expelled? Dude, it's a long story and it's a great story. I'll tell it. Um, okay. Fucking, uh, and this, we're trying to write a feature about this right now too. I need to like fictionalize some of it. So it's more interesting, but, um, uh, so basically at some point in high school, I just turned into like a gigantic stoner, like in my like sophomore year, I got expelled halfway through my sophomore year. I just became like a fucking huge, huge stoner, like just taking like fuck getting high before school and just like, just ridiculous, like just super whack. And, um, and cause I was just like a depressed kid and I had like one homie who was also my stoner friend and it was just like, I had a few stoner friends and it was like, I don't know. It was just like not a fun time in mm-hmm. my life. But, uh, uh, fucking, um, uh, I was, uh, okay. So basically I was in, I was in class one day and, um, and one of my teachers was like, yo, uh, uh, a lot of, okay, wait, okay, sorry, sorry. I'm sorry that I'm fucking up the story. So, no, but okay, no, okay. No. I'm in, I'm in class with my buddy Spencer and, um, me and Spencer are just like the fucking boys. Like we love like fucking around in this one class and we're both just like, kind of like, we don't care about school and he, he was just fucking hilarious and we made each other laugh and we just love fucking with our history teacher. We had history class with each other and, uh, and like he was, we were those kind of kids that like, he like, uh, like hated, but not really like he almost kind of liked us. And he was like, yo, I see that a bunch of you guys are trying to, um, uh, follow my like Instagram profile. Like I'm a teacher. I'm never going to like let you follow okay. my Instagram profile. And we were like, dude, we got to fucking get on his Instagram profile. So yeah. like I found one of his friends on Twitter and like made my Instagram profile, the same profile picture with like the same caption in his <laughs> okay. homie his like lacrosse homie. And he let me follow it. And, uh, and, um, Fucking oh, so you like he, he tricked him. Like, into, I tricked him into like re- accepting my request. So because he thought it was he thought oh, it was his smart. he thought it was his homie. I was wow. like and I was like, dude, this is gonna be so funny, bro. Like I'm gonna go into class. I'm gonna embarrass the shit out of him. So the next day, yeah, it happens. I like take screenshots of like all these embarrassing pictures and I send it to Spencer and like a fucking another girl in that class. And I'm like, yo, like this Instagram profile is so cringy. Like this were they is awesome. actually embarrassing? Yeah, dude, they were like him, like uh, like ironing his like uh shirt in his boxers and it's like uh you know lazy sundays hashtag beast mode like the most embarrassing shit and so so fucking i uh i'm walking into class and um i'm walking to school one day i'm like just like pumped to like roast this fool i'm like dude it's gonna be so fun and everyone's gonna flip and my friend my (laughs) friend was gonna love me dude everyone's (laughs) gonna love me and fucking my friend uh brandon was um uh i just bumped him to him in the parking lot on the way and he's like yo bro i got this uh triple strength bang bar. I'll give it to you for 10 bucks. And I was like, hell yeah, give it to me. So I, I bought that. The fuck is a bang bar. It's like the, I thought it was like the most popular form of edibles. They're okay. like the, I don't know. They're just the chocolate okay. edible things. Okay. And, um, I, uh, I, uh, went to school that class. It was, t- came time for that class. And, um, uh, halfway through the class, I stood, I stood up on my desk and I was just like, uh, lazy sunday hashtag beast mode and li- like literally like my teacher knew immediately he was like like it, he was like immediately like give me your phone and he grabbed it and he's like you can went too far this time and he sat down and he slammed it on his desk and he's like i'm calling the deans like you're gonna have to talk with them about this and i was just like all right like, you just stood up on your desk yeah and i stood just up on my said- desk and i just dude i did some really dumb shit in that class like i remember i did do I, I won't get on a tangent um so anyways like um uh were you high when you did it yeah, it was. Okay, like yeah. you were off you were off the bang bar. I uh, yeah, I was off the fucking bang bar, <laughs> doggy. Um but um uh so I was like, "Oh shit." Like that didn't go the way I thought I was going to go. Like and cuz he, he was fucking pissed. He was like just mad. And um I went over to Spencer cuz they can search through the school. It's crazy. They can go on your phone if they want to. They can search your bag if they want to. They're fucking just how? Because you signed an agreement. You signed or some an agreement shit? at the okay. beginning of the year. It's like fucking a Nazi camp, bro. It's fucking heavy there. But um, so I go up to Spencer. I'm like, yo, dude, I'm, I'm in trouble, dog. Like, uh, uh, pulled my bang bar. <laughs> like, like I don't, I don't know what they're gonna, if they're gonna search my bag or whatever. And he's like, all right, I got you. And so uh, I went and I talked to the deans. They're like, you're gonna get suspended for three days, and uh, like we'll talk to you at the end of the day or whatever. And uh, I was like, okay. So I went back to class. Uh, everyone was gone. I like grabbed my backpack, went to my next class. It was like theater. The bell rang. It's time for lunch. And I'm starting to walk out the door. And I see like Spencer like waiting for me, like asking people like, where's Josh? Where's Josh? And I was just like, I was like, yo, Spencer, like uh, give me back. I walked, up, I walked up to him. I was like, yo, give me back my edible, like, um, 
like, uh, I'm getting fucking suspended. It sucks. It's over. Like, whatever. And he's like, I, what do you mean? I ate it. I ate it. And I was like, all right, we'll give me back the rest of it. Like, I fucking, I want the rest of my bang bar. It's fine that you got high. I don't care. And he's just like, no, I ate it. And I was like, you ate the whole thing? And he was like, yeah, I thought that's what it, that's what you're supposed to do. And I was just like, I was like, why, why the fuck would you do that, Spencer? Like, you're, I'm so sorry. You're going to, you got to throw up. You got to barf. I've never gotten that high myself ever in my entire life. That's like just poisonous. Yeah. Like it was, it was so, I, I'd eat like an eighth of that and gets fucking really high. And I was like, dude, why did he eat the whole thing? He, I just, he fucking thought that he was just going to get high and I wouldn't care. And I was like, whatever. Cause it, cause I had just, I don't know. I had him all the time and he just was like, fucking, I ate it. Okay. And, and I was just like, dude, fucking, I'm so sorry. You got to fucking puke. And like at lunch, like me and all my stoner friends were fucking like, like trying to make him puke, trying to, I was like, dude, it was like stoner crew assemble. Like we all met in the bathroom. I was like, yo, Andrew, you get, dude. And it's funny too. I tell a story and they're like the fucking whitest, funniest names ever. I'm like, yo, Andrew, you go get him food. Connor, you go get him water. <laughs> Josh, Connor, Andrew, and Spencer fucking <laughs> had a weed dilemma, dude. But, um, fucking yeah. So like, we were like, he was like in the bathroom trying to make himself vomit. He's like, I've never vomited before. And like, it hasn't hit him yet. Like, and he's just kind of like, we're, we really freaked him out because we're like, dude, that you, this is not, this can't happen. Like, it's not gonna. Like, you need to go home or puke or whatever. And he's like, I've never puked in my entire life. And we're like, Oh my god, and, and we're, this so is like, a fucking nightmare. So and fucking, there's like this cool, crazy man. There's like security guards and shit that will randomly walk into the bath, the bathroom. So like, fucking, like I'm kicking him in the ass when he needs to get up and pretend like he's not puking. We're like draining. Everyone fucking like whips out their eye drops. <laughs> All of us had him. Fucking, we're like draining his eyes and like there's the reddest eyes I've ever seen in my entire life. He just looks like he's literally like bleeding from his eyes at this so point. He's like slowly it's, it's getting... starting to starting to hit okay. him. And fucking like he like sits down. He's like, dude, I'm 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 high. Like and we're just like fucking. Ah. By the end of lunch, like we almost got him to where like he could like go back to class almost was he had never been high before he had been high before but weed wasn't his thing okay weed wasn't his thing yeah. and um and he's he's like i gotta fucking go to water polo practice and we're like dog you're gonna drown you <laughs> like you can't go and we're like he's like we're like call you he had an older brother we're like call your brother he can take you fucking home and he's just like he's just like nah like like fucking i can't like and we're just like dude fuck like Fucking, I I love this kid, Spencer. Spencer <laughs> was the coolest motherfucker ever. But um, um, yeah. So basically, he goes to class, and um, and fucking, it's the last class. Like, I'm just waiting for the fucking clock to tick, 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 tick. Are you and, in the same class as him? No, I'm not. I'm in okay. Spanish. He's somewhere else. I'm just praying. So you're that, just like, like, God, I hope just, he's not dead. I'm got it. I fucking hope he's just not like collapsing. Yeah. And um. Like, it's like two minutes left of class, like one minute left of, left of class. And I'm just waiting. I'm like, oh, and then fucking security guard comes to my room, hands my teacher a slip. And my teacher's like, and she looks at me and she's like, and I was like, fuck. I was like, dude, fuck, it's over. And I like go in there and I'm expecting to see fucking uh, Spencer and um, uh, it's the teacher. It's, it's, it's just them reviewing the terms of my suspension and they're just like, yeah, so you're suspended for a few days and, uh, and we just need to, um, uh, we interviewed some, some of their kids and we just need to like talk to the people who you sent screenshots of the photos to, so we make sure that this is squashed and these photos don't get around. Um, so we're going to call in Adrian, uh, we're going to call in Spencer and I was like, don't, oh, I was like, no. don't call in Spencer. And they were like, they were like, what? And I was like. They're like, we're calling in Spencer. And I was just like, I just, and there's like a window and I can see him walking up and I turn around and dude, <laughs> he was just not there. <laughs> he was not fucking alive, dude. Holy he shit. was 10 times worse than the way we left him. And I was just thinking like, it's over. It's over. Like there's, he can't. Oh my God. Like, can you imagine like, and I just feel bad fucking for him, man. Like, like, could you imagine eating the most weed f that even a stoner could even like <laughs> comprehend consuming and you're not even a weed person so you're literally just like overdosing and i then could getting, not getting called into the dean of your school about some anything literally anything so like fucking i just hear through the walls like him them talking and then all of a sudden i just hear that's not my phone and from spencer and i was just like what is he saying why is he denying that his phone is his phone just let them have your phone and delete the photos and just go. And apparently like what happened was 
I don't know really what happened, but this is what he told me afterwards is that he opened it up and uh, the first thing that came up was a Google search for I eat an entire edible. <laughs> <laughs> I, what, what do I do? And and then there was there was group and then they went through his messages to find the fucking picture because they're like, all right, you're high, Jesus. And he said he didn't rat on me. I believe him. He's a fucking great guy. He never. I don't think he ever did that. But what, what happened was, um, they can go through your fucking messages. They can go through your fucking Dude, messages. That is such a fucked up invasion Dude, of privacy. Fuck Holy day high shit! School. And fucking, there was just this group message apparently of all everyone in his class because he had that class with a bunch of his friends, and they're like, "Bro, you look like shit. What's up?" And he's like, "Josh Vole, give me this whole edible." So they literally were like, "Josh, the kid," and <laughs> they're like, "Jesus Christ!" So they, so they like literally walk next door. And like, yo, things just got a whole lot worse. And I knew I was just like, and this time they came in with this dude with, with a notepad and a suit on and they kept me in there for 30 minutes alone. And now this guy sits down in the corner An interrogator. Notepad, and no, he's not saying anything. The Dean's interrogating me. He's just sitting there like this fucking writing shit. I'm saying down, dude, high school doesn't need to be that serious. Dude, like it, what the fuck are you doing? Like you're not the I FBI. That, like I you're that just that was the end of my kids. life, dude. And, and it really like that school fucked with me in such a bad way. And dude, it was on April 1st. They called my parents and they were like, yo, your kid student, your son's been caught with drugs on campus. You need to come pick him up. They're like, Oh, my mom's like on my, on her way to pick me up. She's like real funny, Josh. I'm already on my way. Like, like nah. funny April fools. They're like, no, like it's real. And she like fucking freaked out. <laughs> 